And this is Mike Renoir, Northwest Fight Scene, NWFightScene.com. I'm here with uh, Adam Laredo, uh, Bad Company MMA. You can see that, man. He had one of the best fights of the night. Uh, Joe DeRobio called it Fight of the Night. Uh, it was definitely up there. Jake Jackman, uh, he, is, he was the, the, the favorite. You came in and, and you took it to him. Yes. Talk about that fight. You know, going into the fight, uh, he's a big guy, you know, I faced a lot of guys big like that and was an underdog going into those fights, but I just, you know, fight hard, don't give up, and uh, got the victory tonight, and, you know, I got to thank my coaches right over there, you know, Jeff Hatton and Jake Bowson. But, yeah, just kept fighting hard, and a uh, really tough guy, but uh, I got through it, and, you know, came home with the victory. Now, he, uh, he came at you hard in the first round. Yeah. Uh, he may have gassed himself out a bit. It looked like he was getting tired. Did you feel him getting tired in there? Yeah, uh, when he had me clinch up against the cage, uh, you know, he had a lot of weight for me to throw around, so I didn't really want to throw around and waste my gas. So I was going to like, try to use his momentum and everything for advantage so I could throw him. And usually, big guys like that, I didn't want to wear myself out, so I wanted him to wear himself before me. And he did. You know, in the first round, he got really tired fast, and uh, I hit him with a couple body shots, so maybe those kind of shook him up a little bit. And uh, going into the second round, he controlled me a little bit on the ground, but uh, he was on top of me. But uh, instead of trying to carry his weight around and you know me waste my stamina, I was trying to control him for uh, raining some drops on me, some heavy shots. He got a couple heavy shots on me, but uh, you know going into the third round, that's when I really dominated and controlled him and got the victory. You know, laying some heavy shots on him and didn't give up. Just didn't give up. Right on. Now, uh, bad company MMA over there on the coast. Talk about uh, your coach and who you work with and everything over there. I've been working with Jeff TNT Hatton and uh, my main uh, trainer, uh, Jordan Harrington, who actually is a training partner. And uh, he's a little smarter than me, but uh, I got to work and move a lot quicker to get out of those little guys and punches. So it helps me with my cardio a lot, you know. Uh, training over there, you know, we train all around. We train hard, you know, and prepared really good for the night. And if you see the fight tonight, then you know that we train really hard and we come to fight and don't give up. Right on. Now, uh, this is uh, was an amateur fight, right? Yes. And uh, are you looking at going pro at any time? Or are you just going to... Not, not any time soon. I probably feel like I'm three, four, five more fights for me. You know, like, I just won two in a row now and got the motivation and trained really hard and uh, see what we got from here. And uh, hopefully, within a year or something with me, I can go pro. But I'm going to keep training hard and fighting hard and see what I can do and take off from here. All right. Well, anyone to thank for this fight? Uh, this is my coaches, Bad Company, and everybody I train with back at home. Thank you, and Copeland, this wins for you too, so thank you. All right, Adam Laredo, Rumble the Ridge 25 tonight, winner. Thank you, sir, for your time. Thank you.